Knowing that at the end of the day, you can step into the luxury of the M Spa is a joyful feeling. There is nothing as peacefully satisfying as a quiet soak in the warm, therapeutic water of a spa. Make it the focal point of a beautiful garden or tuck it away, creating a secret and intimate setting. M Spa will cater to your every need. Thank you for purchasing the M Spa. Over the following few minutes, we will show you how to set up and maintain your bubble spa. This video is only designed for reference. It cannot substitute for the owner's manual. Please read your owner's manual carefully before you set up the spa. Before setting up, you should choose a flat surface free of sharp objects and debris and is capable of supporting the weight of the spa, the water, and the users. A patio is an ideal location to set up your spa. Our spa is lightweight and can be easily carried by two people. Do not use a knife or sharp object to open the carton. You may cut the spa. Before setting up, please make sure all spa components are present in the package by referring to the owner's manual. Our bubble spa has an integrated pump to help you with inflating. Spread the spa out. Install the smart control panel to the spa. Attach the control panel to the spa by fastening the ring to the pipe adapter. Connect the pin plugs. Make sure that the plugs are properly matched together. Then twist the cap, plug in, and you will see a yellow light on the control panel. Do not bend or get wet the pins inside the male connector, which may cause a failed connection and may cause a replacing of the control panel. There are three incorrect connections which may cause the following malfunctions. Number one, turn signal lines 90 degrees clockwise. The circuit will be lost and the bubbles will stop. Number two, turn the signal lines 90 degrees counterclockwise. Bubbles will start automatically. And number three, a 180 degree difference between the male and female connection and there will be no display on the control panel. If your M Spa comes with an RCD, PRCD, or GFCI plug, please watch the diagram flow for plug use. It is important that you must test the plug to ensure the safety features are functioning properly. To prevent the risk of electric shock, the plug must be tested every time when plugged in. If your M Spa comes with a GS standard and excludes a plug, please contact an electrician for installation. Open the air valve under the control panel. Attach one end of the inflation hose onto it. Attach the other end of the inflation hose onto the manometer and then insert into the inflation valve. Plug in for power. Press the on-off button on the control panel and inflate the spa by pressing the bubble function. Please read the gauge of the manometer. When the indicator rests in the yellow section, the spa is properly inflated. You may now fill with water. Press the bubble function again to stop inflating. Remove the inflation hose from the air valve on the spa. Replace the cap on the valve once the air pressure inside the pool is appropriate. To avoid any air leaking from the valve, try to use some Vaseline or similar product to lubricate the rubber gasket in the air valve. Use your garden hose to fill the spa until it reaches the area between the two water lines printed inside the spa wall. Please avoid water spillage which may cause damage to the electrical parts. Mm -hmm. 
After filling with water, please check the air pressure again and make sure the indicator reads in the green section. Never inflate beyond the green section when filled with water. If there is too much air, please press the black button on the manometer and air will be released. Keep pressing the button until the indicator points to the green section. If there is any air leak, please use a spray bottle with a mild detergent in order to see where the leak originates. Try to find the leak on both sides of the inflated tub and prepare the hole for glue. A hole or split within a 3 inch size and not on a welded seam can be repaired by the material swatches provided in the repair kit. Place the cover onto the spa. If your M-Spa comes with an inflatable bladder, please use it for better heat preservation and water runoff. Lock the spa cover after each use. Press the temperature button for a few seconds. When the LED starts to flash, you can set your desired temperature by pressing the temperature up or down buttons. After setting the desired temperature, it will return to displaying the current water temperature. Press the heater button to activate the heating system. Filter system will be activated automatically and remain active as long as the heat is on. Please reduce the air pressure to the yellow section of the manometer if the spa is left exposed to heat or extreme conditions. Air expands with heat and the spa shape may be compromised if left overpressurized from the heat. It is also a good idea to buy a spa total cover at your M Spa dealer or their web shop. This will protect your pool from harmful UV rays. The spa should only be set up and left outside in temperatures below 38 degrees when the water temperature inside the spa is above 38 degrees. The spa may be used properly in temperatures as low as 10 degrees. However, it must be made sure that there is no frozen water remaining in any of the spa's internal parts. It is helpful to use a temperature barrier mat between the spa and ground, or similar mat which is thick enough and made of a foam material or some other material with a temperature barrier purpose. Press the bubble button to start enjoying the bubble massage. After 20 to 30 minutes of continuous bubbles, the bubble function will stop automatically for 10 minutes. You may then press the bubble button for another 20 to 30 minute cycle after the 10 minute break. Please note, when the power pack does not work properly, there will be a corresponding error code displayed on the control panel. Error code HEF in the display means heater failure. Error code BBF in the display means bubble failure. Error code FEF in the display means filter failure. If control panel loses all power, please consult user manual for troubleshooting help. Maintenance and storage. To maintain spa water, please use a filter cartridge. Twist the filter onto the water inlet on the spa by turning it clockwise. Press the filter button to activate the filtration system. It will help the water inside of the spa stay clean. It is very easy to clean the filter cartridge. Unscrew the cartridge by turning it counterclockwise. The filter cartridge can be rinsed off with a garden hose and reused. We recommend doing that after continuous use of 72 to 120 hours. However, if the filter cartridge remains soiled and discolored, the cartridge should be replaced. We recommend replacing the cartridge at least once a month depending upon use. Please make sure to unplug the power before cleaning or replacing the filter cartridge.
Also note the importance of water treatment. It is the responsibility of the owner to properly maintain the chemical balance and purity of the water. M-Spa is not responsible for any damages that result from improperly maintained water. Improper water maintenance may result in voiding the warranty. Please use a test strip to test the water chemistry before each use of the spa, and no less than once per week. Too low a pH level will result in excessive wrinkles and damage to the spa pool, as well as corrosion in the motor unit. Too high a pH level will result in scale formation, which could result in sheets of white coagulation inside the filter pump, causing it to block and ultimately break the filter pump. Note. 1. You must not use chemicals you have in your house or any leftovers from an outdoor inflated pool or swimming pool. 2. Do not use chlorine tablets. Instead, use chlorine powder and dissolve first in a bottle. 3. Do not mix the water with bath oil or soap, otherwise the pool can be damaged. 4. Use only clean, fresh water. Do not use salt water that will damage the pump. If you have any questions regarding chemicals, please contact your local spa specialist. To drain your spa, please turn off all power to the control panel. Unscrew the valve on the outside of the spa until it is detached from the drainage structure. Connect the drainage hose onto the drainage structure. Make sure it is well connected and the other end of the drainage hose is connected to a ground drain. Pull and open the cover of the drainage structure inside of the spa pool. Water will flow out from the drainage hose. Tilt the spa gently to complete drainage. At the end of the season, it is important to dry your spa completely before storing. After draining, please operate the bubble function for 20 minutes to dry the bottom ring. Take off the control panel from the spa. Disassemble the filter pump from the bottom of the control box drain the water from it. Reassemble the filter pump. Inflate the spa. Hold your spa by pulling the center in and then wrap the rest of the spa towards the center. Put everything back into the package until next use. Store safely in dry, warm conditions and out of sunlight. This video is designed for assembly reference of the following M-SPA models. B110A Blue Sea in blue color, B110B Silver Cloud in silver color, both round shaped with a seating capacity for four persons. B100A Riviera in green color, B100B Alpine in dark gray color, both oval shaped with seating capacities for two people. B090 Alpine in dark gray color and square shape with a seating capacity of two people. Elegance models B140A in blue color, B140B in gray color, B140C in brown color, all with round shape and seating capacity for four people. B130 Camaro in black color, round shape with a seating capacity of four persons. B150 Super Camaro in black color, round shape with a seating capacity of four to six persons. If you have any questions about our product, please visit our website or call the local service center for help. Thanks for watching this DVD.